everybody. Welcome back to the final episode of the campaign. Oh, well, the story mode anyway, not the whole game. There's still a lot of this game to go yet. Um, last time out, we saved ourselves on the very first mission. While we did stuff on the last mission. You know, stuff like that. This time, we're back in 1924. Future perfect. And we just gotta go and get rid of Crow. There's actually no cutscene between this level and the last level. So it just kind of just throws you in there. 14 game modes to play! That's important to know. Nice picture. Okay, no more distractions. Find the crystals. It's the best picture ever. Time machine. The crystals must be nearby. Using unrefined crystal with Crow's time machine should cause a chain reaction leading to a massive explosion. That should destroy the whole base and possibly the island above as well. I'm telling you, I heard gunfire. Don't be stupid. We're at the bottom of the ocean. No one can get down here. I know what I heard. Ah, uh, you've been eating that pipe fungus again. I told you to lay off. It makes you paranoid. Paranoid. Pipe fungus. Yo, know actually, I just want to look at this because thumbnail material. I'm not sure if um, there's any pictures of it on the internet, so that's thumbnail material, hopefully. Up there! Intruder! Intruder! Come on, R110. You've here. got my back. See. I don't think he has a face left now. Intruder! How dare you shoot the robot? Looks like we're going down here. It's all. Spot! Spot! What? <laughs> I don't want to stop. Here it is. The unrefined crystal. It must have been part of a meteorite. Interesting. I believe we have to do something in here. There we go. Take the crystal back to the time machine. I can hardly believe it. After all we've been through, it's finally going to end. Yeah, but it's never that simple, is it? Come on, R110. Oh no. Crows worked out where you went. <laughs> He's become so powerful. He's so powerful he's shooting through the wall. I don't like this. Kick his ass, R110. I wish I could give him a weapon over his pistol. Oh! I messed it up. Because you're supposed to shoot him in the buttocks. Oh, he's got a shield still, that's why I can't hit him. Now I can. Time to run. I need ammo and health. I've not got much survivor. Ooh. Where's our one ten? 
There he is. Come on. Keep shooting him in the back. Out over the front, maybe. So yeah, we've got to shoot all his front parts off so that we can get to his back. Then we blow his ass off. Like so. Well, you can shoot him, but uh, I prefer shooting rockets with his buttocks. And if you can keep his um, things at the front damaged, you can just keep keep shooting at him. Oh. No! I only wanted to be loved. Damn it! <laughs> what do I have to do to kill this guy? No idea, Cortez. Sorry. <laughs> Too bad, because I could really use a hand with this guy. You know, <clears throat> I think I can help you on that one. You crazy? You're not trained for this sort of thing. No, but you are. What? <laughs> Remember all those wormholes? Yeah. Well, what if I sent you back in time to before Crow arrives? We could create a time loop that would allow you to effectively double team Crow. But I thought you said it was dangerous. It is. But I'm out of ideas, Cortez. It's up to you. <laughs> Looks like your time is up. You didn't really think you could defeat me all by yourself, did you? <laughs> No. <laughs> well, yeah, that's right. Now, prepare to die. Maybe later. All right, nice work on you. Now to find myself. Ah, here I am. What are you doing here? I'm here to give you a hand with Crow. Crow? But Crow's not here. We gotta stop me like this. <laughs> Let's go and grab some ammo. Come on, leave me alone. There you go, shot his guns off at least. Not to fail. I need to get some more ammo in a second. That's broken. That's broken. Can grab the ammo. Break his leg again. Suddenly, he's back to working order. Oh, this looks bad. Ammo. I'm sorry, R110. I didn't mean to shoot you. God damn it. Where's the ammo? I didn't pick it up. Go over Cortez go. Throwing himself into him. How can he turn around when his legs are broken? And there we go! We got him! He 
gonna stop shooting him now. I think he's sort of dead. And for that, we unlock Victorian Crow, Jacob Crow, and Mad Old Crow. And Corporal Hart has a throwback. So let us watch this final cutscene unfold. Calamari again. Let's blow this popsicle stand. Set all levels to maximum. Time to split. <laughs> right on. Good job, Cortez. I knew you could do it. Thanks, General. And you brought me back a robot. Cortez, you made it. Thanks to you. Cortez, you're my hero. I know. It's what I do. Cortez is always a hero. And now, we get to go to Tipper's nightclub. And watch Cortez dance behind the credits. So, that's the game, the Big Tipper. I believe this is a um, multiplayer map as well, so we might see it during the challenges and arcades levels, maybe. I don't know, we might do. <laughs> oh, actually, yeah, it is, a, it is a multiplayer level, I remember it, because I remember playing this a lot with my brother this level. This way left the music. The music is awesome. It's too bad R110 isn't there with him. Dancing away like he was at the start of um, that other mission. So, that's the story mode. So, um, after this episode is uploaded, I will be taking a break from this game. But, um, I will be coming back to it like a week or two down the line afterwards. So, um, you don't have to wait long for more Time Splitters Future Perfect. Yes. So, that didn't go too badly, I don't think. I died quite a few times. Could have probably beat the game a lot better than I did. I, mean, I ended up with a lot of levels of, like, really low health. Tom Clark Hill. He's got an awesome voice. I like how no one else has got the, um... doesn't list anyone else's names for characters. Just says, oh, additional voices. So... Mario Club. I didn't even know the Mario Club did get a special thanks to this game. I like how um, the Mario Club's got a special thanks on the Xbox version. I mean, I know it's on the GameCube, but it wasn't on... It, you know, it's... This is the Xbox version, after all. Maybe it's just easier for them just to do that. 
instead of doing it on every single individual game. Given the right thanks. Who knows? I wonder if I could have done this on hard mode. I'm not sure if you get anything else for doing it on hard mode besides just having it done. Um, you might unlock something for doing it all. Like some artwork or something. I, I don't know, I can't remember what you unlock. It's been a long time. I've got the music has a little change here. Well, I actually went pretty quick that last level. I thought it was going to be a bit longer. I don't know why I did, but I just thought it was. I thought I said Dave Grohl then. It was a guy just called Dave Grove. How long, much longer this will go on for this credit sequence? And I just wanted to watch it. It's always nice to show him off afterwards. I don't know why McAfee just came up on my computer. I don't even use McAfee. It's probably a virus. That's a funny story. Um, last time I had McAfee security center on my computer, um, it turned out like that McAfee was a virus itself, it was really weird, it, it found itself as a virus, but it couldn't find anything else, any other viruses on the computer or anything. So that was kind of an interesting moment, and that's why I don't use McAfee anymore, it's terrible. I mean, it's bad when your security system on your computer thinks itself is a virus. <sighs> EA Online. It's too bad this game isn't online anymore. Because, uh, this was a fun online game. It's cool because you could play all the, um, map maker maps on there. Like, you could make a map and just play it straight away online with your friends. I don't think they even had to download it, if I remember correctly. But this was, like, one of the only games I played online at the time, besides Halo 2. And um, conquer live and reloaded. Like they were the only games I ever played on the uh, Xbox Live at the time. Or well, often, I mean. Tapping my foot to the song. Copyright. Free Radical Design. Thank you guys for making a great game. Another great game, anyway. It's too bad you cried at UK now, but... Hopefully, we will be seeing a fourth game in the series, in the future, from these guys. And it's just a loop in the credits again. So, I'm going to say, let's get out of that credit sequence and then we'll sign off for today so that's all those done player progress you can see I've got 13 done on easy and normal I do believe I've done the hard mode before but I really don't think there was anything that you unlocked for uh, for doing the hard mode because I think I got all the characters, unless you do it the last one and you get like one character or something. So, that's it for the story. When we come back to this game, we'll be doing the Arcade Leagues, which is just going to be loads of fun. And uh, eventually, it's a challenge as well. If you play, you will not. Oh, yeah, well, I can't sign in anyway to access the leaderboards on these challenges anyway, so, yeah. So, that'll be it. 
I'll see you. Thank you for watching. And I'll see you guys later.